Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to the Riverside Stadium for this afternoon's EFL Championship Football. It is Middlesbrough. Whoop, this is slippy floor. Middlesbrough versus Sheffield Wednesday. Five games unbeaten in the league at the moment, and we're hoping to extend that one to six games unbeaten. And also, with two games unbeaten at home as well, so can we carry that on today? Hello. Hiya. <laughs> on paper, it's a game we should win. Yeah, that's cool. You know what balls like against these sort of teams. Yeah, we always end up either drawing or losing. But do you know what? I think I'm comfortable with win today. It's just yeah. that uh, last goal by Latter Last gave me some balls. So yeah. yeah, five games unbeaten. Hopefully extend it even further. What's your score prediction, Junior? I'm going to uh, I'm going to go three one, but I think Latter Last is going to score a brace. Yeah. Seven up there. Yeah. Yeah. I think you'll probably be no goal. Check your head today. It would be typical. Put some up their season, ready if it was a known goal. We'll see what happens. Anyway, good to see you. Up the bar, man. Up the bar. Yes. So it is Michael Carrick versus Danny Wall. And of course, the old saying is you got a wall with it. You got a roll with it. You got a take it. Out. Yeah, sorry, I just had to add that in, didn't I? Anyway, before the game, I spoke to uh, my good mate Jake Johnson outside. And let's see what he had to say. Hey right, Jake Johnson with us, I've got to say, really snazzy, snazzy coat. Yeah, very snazzy much. coat. Thank you very much. I could never afford it. <laughs> <laughs> um, on paper, it's a game we should win, but you know what we're like against relegation threatened sides. How do you think we'll do? I mean, looking at our recent form, I think that we've done, I think we've done all right. Yeah. Um, but honestly, I remember you saying just then that uh, we don't do very well against the like, no, relegation sides. Um, been the case for years. It's, it's, been t it's been typical for her, really. Um, but do you know what? I'm, I'm feeling positive. You know what I mean? I mean, if you look at um, how many games we've got, yeah. and we're, we're, we're pushing on uh, for, for playoffs. Obviously, that's the that's the aim. Obviously, it's a very it's a very hard thing to dream of right now. But if we can get a few results by by, by next week or the week after, we could be right up there. Well, we got some hard games coming up. So obviously, the game today won't be straightforward. Yeah. We've got Leeds, Hull, Ipswich all back to back. Yeah. Right, the one order, but we've got them yeah. all three of them back to back to back either it, it, way. Obviously, Different it's, order. It's, it's, gonna be, it's gonna be a tough run. Uh, but look, tough the, one, if, if the boys wanna get in, get themselves into the playoffs then they've got to work for it, they've got to work. It's all down to the lads, yeah. isn't it? They've got to work their hardest and they've got yeah. to do it for the fans. So um, look, I think today it's a must win. If, yeah. you, if, you, if you look at it, it's a it's a must win. Yeah. Um, otherwise, you know, the, you can say bye bye playoffs. You can say goodbye to the playoffs. But look, I think that we won today. Do the job. Uh, I think I think we'll win today. Good. What do you think? We'll, what do you think will be done? Two one. Yeah, I've gone the same. I reckon. I reckon two one. Uh, I went it, the same. Latte <laughs> laugh. Latte laugh. And uh, do what? Lewis O'Brien to get a goal. That's all. Lewis O'Brien. Yeah. April Fool's finished at 12 o'clock, mate. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what I'm going to go with. Well, there you go. Hey, you, at least I didn't say Sunny Dieng. Yeah, I said Sunny Dieng on these vloggers <laughs> a joke because it was April Fool's. But yeah, there you go. All right, good to see you again, buddy. Thank you very much. Up the bomber! Beautiful day. Yeah, beautiful day for the beautiful game. It's peeing down. Now, of course, uh, the last time Sheffield Wednesday won here at the Riverside Stadium was a 4 1 win back in 2019. They scored four goals within the first 35 minutes. Here's a reminder of what happened, and let's hope that doesn't happen today. The defender here headed in. Own goal. I think it's an own goal. Own goal again. Uh, and it's headed in. It's headed in. It's 2 0 to Sheffield Wednesday. Literally less than two minutes after the first goal went in. Yay! Come on, back in the game. 3-1. Uh, and this is getting embarrassing, it's 4-1. Dear me, that was terrible. Come on, you.
Well done, Stewart. Come on, well off. Oh. Oh. Go on in. Gonna out sing the South Stand today, let's be honest. They've been loud and they've only what 10 minutes in it, but come on. Ah, for God's sake. the box as well. Ooh. Right, so dad's not here. Me is with me. Um, and so is my brother and ladder. But uh, my dad's not here today for different reasons. So, uh, yeah, me is joining in. Joining at home. Oh, yeah! Like it was that here laugh with the goal. How did you describe the goal? Because I didn't see it go in. I was busy trying to do the iron blue. That's two games, <laughs> two games on the bounce now that that's happened. Norwich and then this game. What is it with me and missing goals at the minute? It's annoying. Oh yeah, I've got this top on by the way because uh, couldn't find me bubble top anywhere today. Confirmation it was actually uh, Ikiema with the uh, own goal, so it wasn't Latilaf. Latilaf was claiming it, but it was an own goal. Oh, what a shame! Oh, 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 oh. Go for it. Oh, 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 oh. Too late again. There it is. What is it already? I was just going to say. And off for the second half, but we almost scored immediately. So there you go. Come on, fire in second half. Pen! What? Ah! Oh look, he spent all day doing his own, he's come out about it. <laughs> oh. We have all over them now, we need we should get a second goal soon or later. Suddenly get battered. <laughs> Sobs and singing, Sun and getting battered because they're getting beat 4 0 at home to Blackburn. We do 0 0 at home to them last the other week. Oh, for God's sake, you idiot! Hit it! Oh, what a save! It's a good delivery! Yes, the end! Well, according to Flash score, etc., it has gone down as Isaiah Jones' goal, but 
I have a feeling that was another one goal because Isaiah Jones' shot wouldn't have looped up and down. That it took a side deflection which looped it up and down into the far corner. But it's all from a really good counter attack. 2 0, and I think that's game over. Oh, look, it's the former world champion of Dart, Michael Smith. Oh, sorry, that's the wrong Michael Smith, I think it's Dart. <laughs> Fucking hell, that's terrible. Ah, He's given it! Ah, ha, ha. Sam Greenwood, come on, free them, please. Let's have, let's have a go. Come on. Oh, he's hit the post! He's hit the post! Oh, Daryl! Daryl! Okay. Hello, Mr. Gilbert's coming on the field. Say thank you, Mr. Gilbert. I'll say thank you if he scores. Looks like it's going to end 2 0, so still three points in the bag. Six games unbeaten on the uh, bounce in the league, which is very good. And uh, continuing our unbeaten streak at home to three games. But uh, I've got to say, no disrespect to Sheffield Wednesday, but they've been really poor. They have not been great, I must say. And I feel sorry for the fans. I feel sorry for the fans. What's been going on this season? Because it's been all sorts going on this season. You know, the, the owner and the fans uh, clashing. and oh, it's, it's, it's been awful. So, all I'll say to them is the very best luck for the final few games. Um, I would like... I would like Sheffield Wednesday to stay up. Uh, it'd be a shame for them to go down. But performance wise, we've not been good enough here at all. We could have had about three or four. We missed some big opportunities. That penalty, of course. I mean, it wasn't a great penalty, was it? But it's three points in the bag, nonetheless. And uh, not an easy one because we've got um, Ipswich Hull leads all on the bounce. So we've got uh, some difficult games coming up. We'll see what happens anyway. Uh, I'm not going to do a review because uh, I'm going to be in the hobby. So, uh, yeah, so I'm probably just going to finish it all here. Uh, a good win in the end. Well done to their fans, by the way. Brilliant turnout and uh, they made some great noise. Despite the weather being pretty poor for most of the game and despite it being a bank all day. So, mad respect to their fans. Hope you all enjoyed the vlog. I'll see you for the next home game. Bye-bye. That'll be full time, ladies and gentlemen, and good night. Goodbye. Thank you.